my name's Roberta Hagee. I built the Glenel Zip. Um, started on it last August, finished it about two weeks ago. It's, this is probably its fifth time in the water. The boat's mostly mahogany with um, white oak for some of the uh, keel and some of the bantons. Power is a Merc 500, 1969. I have about 900 hours of build time, um, probably a little more than the average zip because of the extra planking that I did on it. The uh, sides are planked with African mahogany and the deck is planked with Philippine mahogany. I probably spent a lot more than the average builder would do. The, I used Okumi, uh, Jubert plywood, which is a little more expensive. Uh, some of the woods were a little more expensive. Some of the hardware was more expensive. And the adhesives I used were probably a little more expensive. Um, so it probably ran to all total with the trailer and the motor, probably around the area of around 14,000. Just before I started building the boat, I got involved on the Glen Hill Forum and uh, looked at a lot of other zip builds. Um, and when I saw Tom Drake's boat with decked out like that, I thought, oh, that, well, that's, I think, something I could handle building. The Forum's been really, really helpful because most of the builders with the Glen Hill line, there's pictures are posted of how they've done things, um, which I also shared my build experience on the on the forum too so there's a just a wealth of information out there one of the things i really enjoy most is when we're places like gas stations or other places you know boat docks where people aren't really aware of what kind of a boat it is they always ask me well what year is your boat when i tell them it's a 2011 they get quite a surprised look on their face. You know, 2011, is that when you refinished it? And I says, no. I says, it's about two weeks old. They don't realize that you can build these classic boats by yourself and uh, save a lot of money and have a lot of fun building it. <laughs>